Hello, hello, hello. This is Darkblade 105, and I am on Seven Days to Die. We're going to be starting off this series. And let's get going. Right. I can see. Let's start the quest off. I'm going to finish up the quest, get to the trader, and get myself going. Morning. Organize all my stuff when I want it. After the, the Alpha 20 has come out, it's it's gone a lot easier to find everything to um, get yourself um, through this first part a lot quicker because it actually tells you where everything is. So. If all you new beginners out there, this will be a great way to get up and started pretty damn quickly because a lot of players have trouble doing this beginning part. Zombies around when I'm trying to um, just on that. Gather some wood, might as well back a tree. Gotta craft a club yet. Yeah? I don't normally use clubs, but I'll craft it anyway. I'm more of a knife person than a club, but I'll make a club for now because it's what well, it's actually going to do. It's. I don't normally use a bow either. <laughs> get a campfire done as well. Need to go and get some stone for that. Nice. Right. One anyway. around this area for starters, let's not go into the town yet. Maybe get some more with moonstone. There's another stone and there's another stone. Let's get the campfire done. <coughs> let's go over to my little cube. Done now. I'm 
just going to go over here to get my to end all my quest path. I'm not going to get a quest straight away because I want to get myself set up. I will collect these. <coughs> this looks like it could be Trader Gen. Get that. Let's look at this place first before I go into it. Get a wood there. Can pick those up. Mm, what I can see, there's nothing up here. <coughs> Go check out back here. It's a far view. I will have that. Birds, vendors. I'm just grabbing everything for now. I'll get rid of it on what I don't need at the minute. Later. Hello, Trader Joe. If you got the Dukes, I'll make the time. Let's see you don't. First encounter. Oh god. It's the um, I think it's the tourist, huh? Go over this one. Let's loot some cars. Got some glue. I'm not going to try and bash my way in there. Let's uh, this chip. Oh. Oh, we'll be good if I can find a, um, a pipe gun. It will be pretty neat to find. Like this, this gives it a hell of a lot of stone. Which we are need to get a forge up and running, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get straight to a forge because I haven't even learned it yet and you're gonna need to get the skill points to even get that. So I'm just gonna harvest all this. First thing first, I'm going to try and get myself so I'm better at combating the, the undead. Can I get any? Yep. Any zombies in here? Nope. Some more sand. Just got some nails. It's always good to get. I can get a box up and running now. <coughs> I'm going to need to find a place I can start stalling for this. Oops, accidentally whacked it. Some more frames. It's always good as well. Let's put that down here. And let's make... Let's make a storage box straight away. Okay. That'll help me to stall my gear. Oh. do start on the roof because for one it's a lot safer being on the roof than what it is being on the floor or in a house if I heard someone running around in fact I think I can hear someone running around you 
can... Ah, oh, God, this is where dogs normally are. Nope. Nope. I can't be dealing with them at the minute. I'll probably die. It's like a... Nope. Mm-mm. I'm not going anywhere near them. Not when I first died, I'll... I'll end up dying. If I have to fight them later, I will, I will obviously try my very best to um, to sort them out. Oh, we've got a better axe. Let's um, get that down there. There's a working stiff towards there, so we'll be popping into there. Let's get up on that roof there. Oh. Get out of here. There's, there's the party girl. What well, used to be called the stripper, but they've changed it. Ow! You beast. Took 8 HP off me. Ah, God. How much HP does this have? Well, that's not bad. I don't mind standing here and watching this. <coughs> Need to take at least. Unless I do loot that star first and try and find a pick. If I can find a pick, I'll put my bedroll down here for now. Just in case I die. Oh, there's my. I can now make a bone shift, so let's get that going. No, I don't need a favour. Let's get that going, come on. That's what I like to use. It's this. That's it, come on. Come on, get your ass down here, go on, let's go. Oh, missed it. Once. Twice. Mm -hmm. This one dead. Further, let's make some bandages just in case I get bleeding on me. And I need to quickly, right, guys, quickly bandage myself. Come on, are you pain in the ass? Show yourself. There's somewhere around here. Here you are. Oh, yeah. Let's move on down and out. Grab that. Try and grab everything I can. Oh, that's nice. And the pair kit. That's really nice. Some more repair kits and that uh, nail. Best thing again. Yep, there he is. Oh, okay. What was that? Sounds like some car. Ish. I'll whack myself in. Open sesame. Oh. Come on. Didn't this used to be the, the, um, the spider something at one point? Looks like it. I can hear something bashing around in the middle. Oops, accidentally whacked it. Oh, that's a nice to find. Iron shovel. Let's get rid of that. I don't really, I don't really do, I don't really do clubs. Nice. That's it. 
make as much noise as, as, I, as I can. <laughs> get this one. Oh, what picks? That's always handy to have. Someone's trying to bash their way in. The businessman. Oh, I call him Steve the Sleeve. <laughs> Come on, Steve. <laughs> Killing it. <laughs> Come on, Steve the Sleeve. That's it. Did I miss anything? Yeah, I did. Let's get looking around. Oh. Says I can loot this one. Nothing on it. Duct tape, that is awesome. That is awesome to have as well. Duct tape, glue, you need to basically pick everything up when you first start off. There's a few things that you can get rid of. But I would, but I would urge you, oh. Hold on. Okay. That's another one dead. Another one back to dust. <laughs> oh, that is a really good find. I will have that. Thank you very much. I'm going to find a knife and a bomb bomb. Okay. What is a knife doing in the car? Find a pistol next, that'd be awesome. Uh, no. Let's <coughs> right, so have a quick look in here. Close that behind me. Don't want someone to sneak up and attack me from behind. Hope I can find some more food. And food and water is. It's okay at the minute. Come on. Moldy meat, that's good for making farm plots. Let's open up this, let's go in here. Come on. <coughs> yeah, get your ass here, come on. Come on. Oh, Five. What the hell? Okay. I decapitated him. <laughs> Good to find his wall straight away. There's a fire axe. I'm gonna still keep my normal axe because that's gonna be good for We're getting the other bits and bobs like metal. Oh just quickly go up here. <coughs> Come on. Open up. <sighs> Knocking out mate. Let's go down by one. Come on, wait. Right. Let's do this. Let me get around here. Oh, looks like looks like there's another box right up there. But since I go near that area, it's gonna be um there's going to be zombies dropping everywhere. Sledgehammer, that's not bad. Come on. I'm knackered again. Oh. Uh, let me... Let me have a... Let me have a... Let me have a... Get my stamina going back up pretty quickly. Come on. That's it. If you find a working stiff toes, it's always good to go in because you get a lot of stuff off it. What you can do. I knew it. Come on. Like, oh, Jesus. 
Come on. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, Everybody at once. Come on. Always good to try and get them in a single file because if you have them all over the place, you're going to be getting whacked by a lot of stuff all at once, and that's when you're going to get bleeding and normally die pretty damn quick. So it's best to try and put them in a single file. That's not bad, I suppose. Let me get up here. Let's Get around here. Enemy on the roof. And the cops over there. Oh, is this the one that normally has a dog on the roof? Oh. Come on. Get out of it. That's it, get out of it. Ow! I didn't even I didn't even know that you woke up. Get out of here. Damn it. I don't even think I've got any... No, I don't have any med kits whatsoever. Yes. And there's going to be a dog. I might have to make a bow real quick. Just to sort out some stuff. Uh, let me... let me chuck that out for now. I don't need sand at the minute. Oh, I can hear something moving. I thought it was next to me then. <coughs> Not my neck. I thought it was frigging next to me then. I was getting scared then. <laughs> Just let me quickly get this sort of stuff up and going. Don't need paper at the minute. Where are you? Hello? I can hear something. I can't see it. They might be dead underneath me. Oh god. I thought I just saw a dog. I did. That's wrong. Always try and get rid of the dogs because it's going to be the animals that's going to kill you. Zombies not too much. They will only kill you if you if they have a mass of them. If, if there is a mass, then they'll kill you. But it's normally the normally the animals that normally kill you on this game. More more than anything, it's going to be the animals. It's such a pain to deal with. Especially if you don't see them and they creep up on you. Because you tend to die pretty damn quickly. So, crack and bookstore across there. Posters might be a good enough spot to set up, set up shop for them. Let's get rid of all these. Do this. Do this here. Dog play. Can't pick up the chairs because I'm full. Let's, let's get some of these tubs down somewhere. So I can Bomb bomb. Okay. Can't find it in there. Now I'm going to need my ward. 
do that, let's get that up there. I'll shove that down in a minute, let's keep my food on me. Put that up there for now. Don't need my bones on me anymore. Don't need that, let's put that up there, glue. Whack all this stuff in there for now. Don't need none of this stuff out at this present time. And that'll do me. <coughs> Let's make some more of those. Um, where's the box? Get some more boxes made. I'm going to be coming backwards and forwards with a lot of stuff anyway, so... Get that, get that... Get rid of that... Eesh. We'll sort that out in a few minutes... Come on. Yep. Nice box is done. Where's my bed wall? Oh yeah, pull it. Pull it outside the shop, can I? Let's, let's just make another bed wall real quick. Is it, then? Let's get rid of this. Little table. I'm knackered again, like I'm always am. That's it. Bedroll down, and I've now got a place to basically respond to if I die. So, put that there, so I've got a bit of light size that I need. Oops, I forgot to search that. I'm a bit quick on the trigger there. Start this dog out, I'm gonna get a bow, hide. Something locking around still. I can't sit. You must have said on the knees, me. I'm not thinking it's next to me. It's on the knees, me. So I've just done that. I might leave that ta table there and stick my furnace on top of it for now. Alright, let's get this other stuff in here. Like I said, you just want to be holding a lot of this stuff. I'll put my eggs in there for now as well. I'll put that down somewhere as well. Just so it's off me. Put it there for now. <coughs> now it's time to do a lot more looting. And then I'll sort this place out at a later date. Ooh. What's down here? Oh yeah. Uh, Oops. Damn it. It's just, uh, he just, just fell down. So <laughs> that's helped me out as well. Oh, I'm level two, five skill points. Damn it. I'll have a look at that when I've got more lock picks. Now. I think I've got some lock picks in my chair. But, because of me not having the skill for that, it's going to probably break all of them and I'm not going to get anywhere anyway, so I might as well hold off on that one until I get... I might have somebody fell down here somewhere. 
Ah, é isso? Chama. Não me means when you're getting swarmed, all there's more than like two or three of them coming at you at once. Well, that's the... That's the tourist. Come on, you burper. Himself, he can do to the ice that I think I've done a really good job with the knife now. Now, now that they put bleeding on the zombies now, and I'm now uh, hungry. Let's start that out. It's empty. I'm looking for any good schematics that can boost me up. Hello? Hello? Uh, let's have a look. Just paper, it looks like. Been through here? Oh, I think I did. Yeah, yeah, this is that star that I Hello? What are you doing up there? Come on. What, what are you stuck? There. Yep, I'm just gonna leave them up there on. Where is he? He's on this bit somewhere. Well, I'll pop him here anyway. I'll leave him out there. He can beat his way down. Oh, he's here. That's how he got there. Go on, down. Get me some coffee. I've got some... I think there's coffee beans. Yep. I can grow myself some coffee. Let me have a look. All I'm doing is, is I'm just trying to get as much looting as I can now. Where it gets to the point where it's night time, because night time is when they, they saw me start running around. I think it's around 10 o'clock. Oh, it's like 10 minutes before, so... Somewhere around there, anyway. That's going to have a dog in it, that normally has. And I'll probably die with that. I know I've got a knife, but... Nowadays it's better to have either a, um, a bow or a gun on you just to attempt those sort of places because you can shoot them dead in, dead in the head then and get rid of them. That's nice to have. Where is There you are. Come on. Come on. Monks in the head. Come on. That is always nice to find. Got some shirts. Yeah, let's put that on. Let's grab let's grab one for now. I can make some more bandages from out the cloth. If and when I need them. Which probably will be, especially if the dog catches up to me. Because that will put bleeding on you, it can give you infections, it can sometimes sprain your ankles, sprain your arm. And when you have all that on you whilst trying to um, get away from from the dogs or the zombies, it tends to, um, yeah, it's, it, it's a burden to contain that. Oh, it is a burden. So I'm going to be wanting to loot the major places first. Like the shops, um, working stiff tools, Shamway's food. 
because in that way I'm going to get the food as well. I'm going to have to go hunting, I'm going to set up a fire. Tons to do yet, but we'll get a fire up and going now. Probably get two. <coughs> There's not many zombies in this. Not many. There's a chair there that can pick up. Ain't nothing in there. And those of you that doesn't know much about Seven Days to Die, at, at the bottom, just underneath my toes, there is a bar, which is the durability of the core uh, weapon. So I need to keep an eye on I don't want, want to be fighting and then it breaks because that will be quite annoying. Because then I'm going to have to make, make a quick runner for it just to get a repair kit just to repair them back up. Oh, I've got a water source in. There's a place that I, that I would never go to, I can tell you now, but if it's the only water source around, you do what you got to do. So I've looted that. Looks like the next best place to go is probably this restaurant here. God, I'm naked. We've got big sponge over there. We've got Maggie's corner calf. That'll be. That should have a good source of food. Then we've got a motel just across the street from me as well. going to deposit on what I've got. Did I just see? I did. I'm sorry about that. It makes such a weird noise when it dies. When I first start playing this, I thought that uh, that looked like a little puppy, but... <laughs> but then I got informed it was a rabbit. But I never saw it like alive. Oh, I always saw it when someone killed it, so it looked like a little, a little, like, puppy. Kind of weird. Where the hell did he come from? Mr. Crane from up there. Get off me, go on, that's it. Oh god, see look, I've now got an infection. You can get honey, herbal antibiotics, or the, I think it's antibiotics, because the, if you blow 5% of that, of the infection, you can use a honey. If it's below 10%, you want to use a herbal, an, uh, the herbal antibiotics, because that does 10% or lower, and the antibiotics, I believe that does 25% or lower, so. They are the three antibiotics that you can get, which can um, help you in the long run and to keep you on. I want to set. I anyway, just need to get back on top here. Oh, I just, he wants me to go up there. Ooh, that's glass. Let me, let me go back in the store. the way I got up was in here, turn left, use the ladders, I am just making a sweep just to make sure that there wasn't any zombies below me, but nowadays they're normally everywhere, especially if they're here, yeah. Start sorting this out. Once I've got a lot more stuff, I'm now hungry, that's why I got some meat. Oh, I can actually take that now. Just get rid of my infection. Because you never want that on you for a long, a long, a very long time. Because 
you want to try and get uh, get rid of that as soon as possible. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. So, let's put that on the glass jar. Actually, I might take the glass jars and grab some water. Let's grab the chair. And that will do for now. Hmm. Yeah, I can pull it out of there. thinking why the hell are you putting two down just how I've always done it stick that in there just get some charred meat going for now just to put my hunger just up a bit just a tiny bit now I've got this don't really put me up a lot but it will do for now get a drink I'm going to go find a pan and a grill because then I'm gonna then I'm gonna need to try and get a lot of schematics. Let's have a look actually at my skills. Um, I've got five points, so let's put that in the one sexual Tyrannosaurus. Pack mule. I'm gonna get minus 69 and mother load. And I'll put the last point into Hmm. Let's put it into deep cut. Gets me so I can do more damage with a blade then. Right. That will do for the first episode. I hope that you did enjoy it. And I will see you next time. Bye!